Hi students, welcome to my YouTube channel, Lokesh Gupta Chemistry Classes. One small announcement students, from today onwards I want to continue my channel with the name Lokesh Gupta Chemistry Classes. Previously this name is Gupta's Chemistry Classes. Okay, come to today's point. Here today's our topic is JE means 2020 below 1000 target, target below 1000. Now, see students, to reach the big goals, proper planning is required. Now, now, to get the proper planning, before planning, we have to do analysis of the previous papers also. That's why today I am going to uh, do analysis of JE means 2020 January question papers. So based on this analysis, what I am suggesting is from today onwards, all of you plan for the July spell, May JE means exam. Nearly 48 days you have now. So in that 48 days, better to split that one into phase 1 revision, 36 days, phase 2 revision, 12 days. In the phase 1 revision, 12, 12, 12, physical chemistry 12 days, organic chemistry 12 days, next inorganic chemistry 12 days, equal weight is. Why equal weight is? That's why now I am going to explain that to me. Now first, let me explain, let me explain the class wise weight is, class wise means 11th class that is intermediate first year, 12th class that is intermediate second year, weight is. See, here in this table I given exam day to 11th class, 12th class. From 11th class, how many questions? From 12th class, how many questions given in that paper out of 25 questions? See, 7th January, 4 noon, that is morning. From the 11th class, 12 questions out of 25. From the 12th class, 13 questions out of 25. 12.5, 12.5 not possible. Na? So 12, 13 given. So in the 7th morning January, they given equal weight is for 11th class and 12th class. Next, 7th afternoon also. 7th afternoon also, they given nearly equal weight is. Next, 8th morning also. Little bit difference is there. 8th morning, 2 questions extra given from the 11th class when compared with the 12th class. In the remaining days, 8th uh, afternoon, nearly equal weight is for 11th class, 12th class. 9th also, 9th morning and afternoon also, nearly equal weight is. Now see, 7th 2 papers, 8th January 2 papers, 9th January 2 papers. Totally 6 papers, 6 into 25 questions, totally 150 questions, uh, 150, 50 percentage is 75 now, see, uh, 6 papers together, from the first year, 74 questions, from the second year, 12th class, 76 questions given, so from this, what is the conclusion students, they are giving the equal weight is, they are giving the equal weight is, both for 11th class and 12th class. So, in our planning, in our planning, you have to give equal weightage, equal weightage for, for 11th and 12th class. So, this class wise weightage over now. Now, I am going to give the another analysis. Let me rub the board. Branch wise weightage. All of you know, in chemistry, three branches are there. Inorganic chemistry, organic chemistry, physical chemistry. Of course, general chemistry is also there. Here, under general chemistry, two chapters. Environmental chemistry, chemistry in everyday life. But here, environmental chemistry, I take it under, under the inorganic. Chemistry in everyday life, I take it under the organic chemistry. Now, for which branch, they give more weightage. You only can give the uh, conclusion. Mm -hmm. See, if you totally 25 questions now, 25 by 3, 8.33, 8.33 not possible, na? so they have to give 8, 8, 9 questions, 
then that is equal weightage. See, seventh January morning, from the physical chemistry, out of twenty-five, eight questions. From the eleventh class, five questions. From the twelfth class, three questions. Organic chemistry, out of twenty-five, eight questions. From the eleventh class, three. From the twelfth class, five. In organic chemistry, nine questions out of twenty-five. From the eleventh class, four. From the twelfth class, five. So what is the meaning? Seventh January morning, they are given equal weightage for three branches. Next, seventh afternoon, eight nine eight means what? They are given equal weightage. Eighth morning only. When compared with inorganic, one question extra given in physical. One question na. No need to consider that one. Next, eighth afternoon, eight nine eight equal weightage for three branches. Ninth January morning, eight eight nine. Here also equal weightage. Ninth afternoon, nine nine seven. Here one question less in organic, but that is negligible. Now totally three days, three to six papers. Six into twenty five, one fifty questions. Out of one fifty. From the physical chemistry, totally fifty-one questions out of one fifty. From organic chemistry, fifty-one questions out of one fifty. From inorganic course, from inorganic, forty-eight out of one fifty. So from this, what is the conclusion? They are giving the equal weightage for inorganic, organic, physical. So when planning your study plan, you have to give equal weightage for inorganic. organic and physical so this one over now now i am going to give another analysis let me rub the board now chapter wise weight is first let me explain in the physical chemistry a totally chapter and chapter sort there as per ncert first year five chapters second year five chapters structure of atom that is atomic structure some basic concepts that is stoichiometry states of matter that is gaseous state thermodynamics in this only thermochemistry also equilibrium it is the combination of chemical equilibrium ionic equilibrium ionic equilibrium means acids and bases next second chapter solid state solutions electrochemistry chemical kinetics surface chemistry now see seventh morning seventh evening like this i given no? if you go through this analysis now what you are observing from each chapter approximately in every paper we are seeing one question see structure atomic structure almost in every paper one question now but stoichiometry little bit extra questions we observed next to here also states of matter also almost in three papers they given one one question thermodynamics next to chemical equilibrium chemical and ionic equilibrium on c from this more number of courses we observed see the remaining analysis also only one point is from solid state only we observed a very less number of questions if we go through the total number of questions only for solid state chapter much importance not given in the january spell so from this you cannot <laughs> i cannot suggest that You, have, you can neglect solid state. That one also important chapter only. In the July spell, they may give the questions now. Now see if you observe this total number of questions from the stoichiometry and from chemical and ionic equilibrium more number of questions given. Now at beginning what I suggested physical chemistry twelve days now ten chapters. So for each chapter one day, but for stoichiometry two days and for chemical equilibrium two days. For the remaining Eight chapters, one 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 day. So totally twelve days. So better to do twelve days in this way planning. Now physical chemistry over now. So let me explain the weight is in the organic chemistry. Let me rub the board. Now weight is in the organic chemistry. As per the NCERT in the organic chemistry, first is chapters two, second is chapters seven, nine are there. Of course, even in the first year, two chapters are there. See. Some basic concepts that is GOC. In this introduction, nomenclature, 
qualitative quantitative analysis purification next to isomerism electron displacement in covalent bond all these i taken now basic strength i taken under the amines next this hydrocarbons it is the combination of alkanes alkenes alkanes and benzene so even though looks like two chapters this is nearly two chapters this is nearly three four chapters so almost in first year second year nearly organic equal it is equal to five chapters see from the first year organic nearly 25 questions from the second year organic 26 totally 51 questions out of 150 in the six papers given now if you the if you see this analysis now here from the halo alkanes and halo erenes they given only one question so it doesn't mean that they neglected this chapter actually in this chapter preparations of halo alkanes alkyl halides we can discuss that one under the properties of alkanes that is halogenation Next, chemical properties of haloalkanes, those are the dehydrohalogenation, elimination reactions, even E2 mechanism. Those also comes under the hydrocarbon chapter. That's why little bit of number of less persons. And one more point, from the polymers, in the, all the six papers together, they given two questions only. Little bit less importance they given. Memory basic chapter. Na? Now, Previously, what I suggested for organic also, 12 days I suggested. But here, 9 chapters only, you know, as per NCRT. Now, what I am suggesting is, for GOC, 2 days. For hydrocarbons, alkenes, 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 benzene, 3 days. 2 plus 3, 5 days. 2 plus 3, 5 days. For remaining chapters, 1, 1 day. But better to give for this chapter aldehydes, ketones, carboxylic acids and its derivatives. It is a big chapter in chapter now. So for this one, two days I am suggesting. So for basic concepts, GOC, two days, hydrocarbons, three days, aldehydes, ketones, carboxylic acids, two days. For the remaining chapters, for each chapter, one day. So 12 days. Better to plan like this. So it is the weightage and the planning for organic chemistry. Now, next to inorganic chemistry. Let me rub the book. Weightage in the inorganic chemistry. As per NCRT in the inorganic chemistry, 10 chapters are there. From the first year, 5 chapters. From the second year, 5 chapters. Periodic table, chemical bonding, hydro and its compounds. S block, that is 1A, 2A. P block 1, group 13, 14, first chapter, second year, P block 2, group 4, 15, 16, 17 and 0 group elements, metallurgy, B and F block 2, complex compounds, environmental chemistry. By looking at this table, what you are observing, you are coming to here now, now in the coordination compounds, that is complex compounds from the chapter, in every paper, solid, Two, 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 two questions they given. Totally 12 questions. So in the January spell, they given much importance for complex compounds. So now, now in the July spell, may they may give. So you give much importance for complex compounds. Next, after that, in the periodic table, they given seven questions. Next, from the P block 2, that is 50, 60, 70 and 0 group together, also seven Questions given. Remaining chapters almost nearly equal weightage. But see, in the January spell, they neglected the P block 1, that is group 13 and 14. They neglected only group 13 and 14. Except this, for the remaining chapters, they given almost nearly equal importance. I suggested 12 days for inorganic also, but 10 chapters are there. So, for complex compounds or coordination compounds, all of you alert minimum two days. All of you alert minimum two days. Next, after that, for P block 2, that is group 15, 16, 17 and 0 group. Four chapters now. For this one also, you alert to two days. Two days, two days. Of course, 
for a periodic table, even the little bit number of more questions given, no need to give two days. For that one also, one day only. So complex compounds, two days. Second year P block, two days. For the remaining chapters, for each chapter, one day. So it is the weightage of an organ. So it is the analysis of 2020 GE means January spell. So, okay students, now based on this analysis, all of you plan, your study plan. What I suggested, 36 days phase 1 revision, 12 days phase 2 final revision. So, this one, all of you plan very well to get to below 1000 rank. Definitely, if you plan very well and you implement that one sincerely, you can get to an open category below 1000 rank. Okay, now from my side, from tomorrow onwards, I am going to give the solutions for this, but not the paper wise. Chapter wise, I am going to give. That one will be more useful to you. That one will be very more useful to you. See, for this also, I am going to give the assignment. Assignment on the similar models and important concepts in the same chapter. So, for this also, you will get the assignment. Don't forget to solve that assignment. That one. So, all of you plan properly and use my assignments to get below 1000 rank in open category. So, okay students, if you like my channel, please subscribe my, cha my channel. Okay, tomorrow we, we, we meet with the physical chemistry chapter. First, I will start with the physical chemistry atomic structure. Bye students, have a nice day.